Friday was a day full of emotion and enthusiasm. Before visiting a juvenile detention center, the Pope stopped at a school to visit more than 400 Cuban pilgrims present at World Youth Day. The meeting was not scheduled and the Cuban pilgrims were filled with excitement. The Pope wanted to personally thank them for attending this global event. Although Pope Francis visited Cuba in 2016, the state is very reserved about religious freedom. That is why it was considered historic that more than 400 Cubans could travel to Panama. Afterwards, Pope Francis got into his vehicle for one of the most emotional meetings of the trip. He visited a juvenile detention center. It offers rehabilitation to nearly 200 young prisoners, most suffering from drug addiction. At the center, they begin a reintegration process through professional training courses and psychological assistance. Pope Francis arrived at the center with messages full of hope. He told them not to be discouraged by the whispers and gossipers who criticized them for the mistakes they made and who did not give them a second chance. Con la vida de la gente parece más fácil poner rótulos y etiquetas que congelan y estigmatizan no solo el pasado, sino también el presente y el futuro de la persona. Le ponemos etiquetas a la gente. ¿no? Este es así, este hizo esto, este, y ya está. Y tiene que cargar con eso por el resto de sus días. Sí, son esta gente que murmura, los chismosos, son así. Y estos rótulos, en definitiva, lo único que logran es dividir. Acá están los buenos y allá están los malos. Acá están los justos y allá los pecadores. Y eso Jesús no lo acepta. Eso es la cultura del adjetivo. Nos encanta adjetivar a la gente. Nos encanta. The Pope said that a society is lost when it spends its energies on criticizing and murmuring because it divides. He said that whoever believes in people looks for ways to unite and overcome differences. At the end of his speech, he received several gifts from the inmates, such as this license plate with the initials Vatican City State in Italian. The Pope also spent a lot of time confessing to several of the young prisoners present.